Hey everyone, Josh here with Gateway Travel. Today we're going to talk about setting goals, and not just setting goals, but setting smart goals. You know, setting goals isn't just about keeping yourself accountable, or making sure that you get things done, or setting a timetable, or any of those other reasons. Setting goals are also about giving yourself a passion, giving yourself something to shoot for. Setting goals gives you something to aim for higher than you ever thought you could reach. So in this video, we're going to talk about how to set SMART goals for your business. So what are SMART goals? Setting SMART goals helps you clarify your ideas. They, they help you focus your efforts. They help you become more efficient into reaching the goals that you set. SMART is an acronym for Specific, Measurable, Achievable, Relevant, and Time Sensitive. So in this video, let's use an example in the travel industry and in how to set SMART goals. So for our example, let's say that you want to set a goal of selling cruises. Now, it's not a bad goal. I want to sell cruises. But let's go ahead and put this goal through our SMART formula and see how it turns out. Instead of just saying, I want to sell cruises, let's start by making it more specific. Instead of, I want to sell cruises, which could mean anything, let's say, I want to sell Royal Caribbean Cruise Line cruises. Okay, so we've taken, I just want to sell cruises to, I want to sell Royal Caribbean cruises, and we've made our goal more specific. But that's not enough, so let's take the next step and put something measurable and attach that to our goal. So instead of saying, I want to sell Royal Caribbean cruises, let's say, I want to sell 1,000 Royal Caribbean cruises. So we've taken our initial goal of I want to sell cruises, changed it to I want to sell Royal Caribbean cruises, then we put a value onto it, a number onto it. So now we're going to sell 1,000 Royal Caribbean cruises. So now I know what you're saying, Josh, I can't sell 1,000 Royal Caribbean cruises. That's a lot of cruises. Now some experienced agents who sell groups and who are really moving and have established their travel agency could probably sell a thousand cruises. But let's make it a little bit more achievable, which is the A value in the SMART goals. So instead of saying I want to sell a thousand Royal Caribbean cruises, let's make it more achievable, take that number down a little bit and say I want to sell 100 Royal Caribbean cruises. So we've taken our goal of I want to sell cruises, taken it to I want to sell Royal Caribbean cruises, to I want to sell 1,000 Royal Caribbean cruises and threw it into our A, achievable, of our SMART goals and said, now I want to sell 100 Royal Caribbean cruises. So now one of the most mysterious letters of the SMART goals theory is relevancy. Is this goal relevant to my business? Will this goal help me achieve my focus, my mission, what I've set out to start this business to do? Now, I would say that selling 100 cruises would definitely help my business, but does it help yours? Maybe you have something different to focus on in your business and you don't want to sell 100 Royal Caribbean cruises. If that's the case, you need to identify that and change your goal. But in this example, yes, it is relevant to our business. And so selling 100 Royal Caribbean cruises passes our goal. So lastly, we all know how to spell SMART. We still have a T left, which is our time sensitivity. Let's take this example and run it through time sensitive material. So we started out that we wanted to sell cruises and have transformed the vision or the goal rather into, I want to sell 100 Royal Caribbean cruises. But we didn't give a timetable to it, which we have to do if we want to maintain a good set of goals. So for this goal, we're going to say, I want to sell 100 Royal Caribbean cruises in the span of three months. So we've taken our original goal of this, I want to sell cruises, which could mean anything. And we've taken it through each step of our SMART goals theory and said, I want to sell cruises. No, I want to sell 100 Royal Caribbean cruises in a span of three months. So that's all there is. So whatever industry that you're a part of, whether it's the travel industry or it's something different, all you have to do is put your original goals through the SMART goals formula to achieve more depth to your vision in your goals. So the next step, no matter what business you're in, 
is to write down a list of ideas and a list of objectives to help you reach your goal. So thanks for watching this video. If you want more tips and tricks in the travel industry, please subscribe, like our video, throw a comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. I will see you soon.